Hey guys, quick video today about Dapper Volk. Today is the last day of the alpha test, and I have just one thing I really need to clear up before I launch into final thoughts about alpha testing. The number one thing that I absolutely must address is the support bundle. I feel awful about this. I didn't know if the alpha support bundle was available to other users and some people commented like oh my gosh it's like basically the light sprite situation from fly rising and my opinion is you shouldn't like release things that are only available to like uh, the early supporters because then the items become very expensive down the line so uh, i was like a little skeptical of this whole support bundle i didn't really know what was going on i should have done my due diligence and read close to things because it turns out that the alpha support bundle is available to anyone even if you do not have a Dapper Volk account yet which is majority of my users you can still get the support bundle the support bundles role is that it is to help Dapper Volk fund their site before the Kickstarter in this pre-Kickstarter time they're paying for everything out of pocket they've paid for everything up to this point out of pocket and this is just a way to show your support for the game. So the USD support bundle is $20 and it comes with a limited pet, limited avatar items, and then some other items. When I realized that I was misinformed, I went out and I bought a few support bundles, especially because all of the progress from the alpha test is gonna be wiped on the 20th. So I just wanted to make sure that I secured it and that I had it for the later gameplay. So if anyone out there is worried or upset that they weren't able to support it, I really hope I can get this video up and out early enough that enough people see it that, hey, if you wanted to support this game and you wanted to have that limited pet, you can and you should right now. Okay, so I'm really embarrassed that I didn't do all my due diligence about that, but the support bundle is on sale until the end of alpha testing on April 20th. So go for it. I purchased more than one support bundle. Back to a general overview of the game. So I'm in love with Dapper Volk. The only reason why I kind of phased out playing in the last few days is I've been really busy with work. And additionally, all of the progress is wiped at the end of the Dapper Volk Alpha test, and uh, as well as the Alpha, I assume. And so there wasn't a whole lot of incentive for me to continue through. They isolated some major glitches with the game that need to be fixed. I gave my feedback about the reward system, and there wasn't much else to do. I will say that the design of the site is so cute and innovative, and I think that you guys are really going to love it. My only like little tidbit of criticism is that the colors are too similar and light in some instances. There's not enough contrast for text. And you know, that's a really a stylistic thing. And I wouldn't be surprised if in the future, Dapper Volk implemented different site themes, or if you go to different places, or if you level up, or you have different stats, that you can have a different site theme. I really like the avatar. If you're going to do a humanoid avatar, it has to be everything. It cannot be weird uncanny valley. It has to be wonderful. You have to wanna to write home about it. And I wanna write home about the Dapper Volk avatars. They are so cute. I wish there was an open wardrobe feature where you could just dress them up and save outfits. I think that's a huge part of having any doll dress up game. Like if Dapper Volk released a wardrobe feature that you could just try on outfits on a, uh, a dummy avatar and save to a wish list or something like that, they could send Virtual Pop Star packing and none of us would ever know about Virtual Pop Star again because these avatars are the cutest little critters that I've ever seen in my entire life. And the site designed wardrobe, those items, the clothes, the hair, it's so beautiful. It's excruciatingly beautiful i love all of the site art from there i have to i i have to absolutely rave about the npcs so this if you guys like animal crossing then this is your game times 5000 the npcs 
are the cutest little NPCs. The designs are so clever. They're so cute. They're so of the time as well. You know, you've got some non-binary characters. You've got some across the spectrum of sexuality. And it's just a good time and place to be alive. These NPCs are so cute. Their colors are so beautiful. They're worth it. I love everything about the character design on Dapper Volk. Those things so far are great. The site design's great. The avatars are great. The NPCs are great. And then, of course, I really like the questing system. I pointed out in my previous video that I would like a different reward achievement cycle that more so drives home the, the thought that you've completed a quest. You know, this is a good thing. It makes you feel good. It has implications. You want to keep playing. So that's my only real stance about the quests. I think they're neat. I like the way that they're set up. I love the mini games and I am not a mini game person. I will avoid them at all costs. You know, my relationship with Neopets is that Neopets is an economy simulation. This is very different than that. There is an economy, like there are user shops and there's, you know, trades markets and there's a bank, but it's not so much that. It's a, it's a lot more like Animal Crossing than it is like Neopets. Like I said, there is an economy, but I don't think that Dapper Volk is an interface on an economy. I think it's an RPG with a doll dress up game. That's essentially what it comes down to in my opinion. I really love the pets that you can create. I hope that they really expand on those moving forward. And yeah, uh, I am so excited. I am going to Kickstarter support the heck out of this game. When I was sick like two weeks ago, I remember like I was like laying in bed and I had like tissues everywhere. And the only thing that I wanted to do, I didn't want to play Neopets. I don't want to play Flight Rising. The only thing that I wanted to do was play Dapper Volk. It was the only thing making me feel alive. And this game is so cute. It's so fulfilling. I'm really excited about it. I'm not quite sure what it's going to be like when it launches or when it enters its next phase, but I'm excited to see it. It is so cute and it's really changing things. It's, I, I love the RPG element. I think that that is just so cute. Anyways, I really needed to get this out here as soon as possible. So apologies for the sloppy editing, but the support bundle, if you want to have that rare pet and if you've got $20 to spare, totally do it. I'm so embarrassed that I didn't mention it earlier because I feel like we could have given them a whole lot of support and I feel awful for not noticing my ish my you know my problem until now essentially. So if you're interested in supporting it while it's pre-kickstarter, do it while you can. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.